there something over there? Yeah, there is. I bet you this way takes me to it. It looks like it probably will. So let's do it. Thing around here. It's way out that way. Hi there. No thanks. Nope. Not happening. Let's get rid of that black nastiness. I do not like tar all over me. Flowers and teeth. I guess that's just saying what's in here is flowers and teeth. So I'm out. Hold on, is there something? No. Looks like there might be. You're gonna dodge right off the edge there, buddy. <laughs> Don't think so. Gotta be careful not to go off the edge here. Getting rather close. You know, the reason that all these guys fail is because all of them have forks and spoons. If one of them had a spork, he would probably be able to kill me. The spork is definitely the ultimate weapon, I'm telling you. If anyone wants to kill someone, it's got to be a spork. That is the way to do it. Silly madcaps. No sporks. Alright. Our way on up. Come here, Mr. Gear. I saw you moving there. Almost uh, got enough to upgrade this Warpal Blade again, which I think I'm probably going to upgrade this Warpal Blade as far as it can go before I upgrade anything else, because I like the Warpal Blade a lot. It's definitely my flavor of weapon. Hi there, Madcap. Nice golden teeth. And nothing. Like a big old gear castle. Alright, I need to get to this gear. Without falling down. That was a little easier than I thought it was going to be. Okay. I hear a pig snout. Ow. Ow. Why did my dodge not work there? Alright. This is going to be a little bit difficult with two of these guys. I am getting ruined right now. Let's see if I can find some help. There we go. take care of that anyway. Not a super big problem. I did a little damage, but not enough to make it very dangerous. Where's this pig snout? I do not know. 
I'm guessing it's going to be another one that's kind of hidden about. Guess we'll find out soon enough. Ouch. Hey, I was not fighting you. There we go. Battle was getting a little bit rough there, but not so bad. I've started upping the ante just a tad. Why, Hatter, you've gotten a little bit rusty. Hmm. Pig nose. Where might you be? Ow. Jerk. Hmm. Sounds like it's right here. Pig nose. Where are you? Hmm. There's a panel down there. Perhaps a good spot to look for the pig nose. Alright, anyway, I'm gonna go over here first. Because there's a flower. Pignose basket and a house. And invisible platforms. Interesting. Alright, so I guess the big nose might be in there. Let's see. Just float where the tooth is. Perfect. What we got in here? Ah, there it is. I was looking for you, and I found you! Ha ha ha! Your basket of teeth is mine! Yep, I guess the faster you hit it, the uh, faster you get whatever's in it. My heart is open, Alice. Never closed. Never locked. It needs no key. Mm hmm. I see. That's an odd thing to say, but okay. Alice has a slightly weird life. Hold on, is there something over there? Actually, I might need to go over there. What it's looking like is yes. Alright then. Let's move along then. Do I really need to wait for that thing, or can I make it over to that? I don't know, let's try. And nope. Just a little bit out of reach. And now it's super easy to get to. Alright. I mean, those teeth. Can I get up there? There's definitely some dice cubes up there. Perhaps, if I open this, I'll be able to get to it easier. Hmm. Maybe not. I might be able to get to it from that one, though. So that's probably the way I need to go. What do we got down here? Hello? Anything cool in here? Awfully long hallway for not being the right way. Hey. Ouch. All right, then. I suppose I should start making better use of the uh, targeting system. 
might help in those battles with a ton of things. Hello. Bricks are rocks, Alice. A brick house, like Gibraltar, is impervious to fire, weather, and the indecencies of Barbary macaques, should the need arise. Really? I don't know about that. Not sure I trust that it is so immune as you think it is. Alright, let's see if I can't make my way up to those dice. Not this way, though. She did not turn the way I wanted at all. <laughs> oh well. I can always try again. There we go. Oh, come on. I thought I had it. Alright then. My foot was just below it, and it did not want to allow me up there. There we go. I knew I could get up there. It seemed easy enough. And mine. I think a tooth just fell down there. Which is somewhat disappointing to me. Not very disappointing, but somewhat. I hear a snout. Where does it be? Why, hello! Alright then. Let's sneak on over here and get you from this angle. Aha! Way up. And another bottle for my collection. Actually, you know, the more that I collect these bottles, the more I'm starting to think that they might be pill bottles. In other words, Alice is connecting or uh, collecting her medication in Wonderland. Interesting. Is that a keyhole? That is totally a keyhole. I think I'm supposed to be going this way, so let's go through the keyhole. Let's see what we got in here. Actually, that keyhole looked like it might have been blocked by something. How did I get through there? Can I? There we go. I know you hear me, you contrary child. Use the bedpan, and let go of that wretched rabbit! Uh-huh. So she kind of took it from me. Even though she said someone else took it from me. I guess that about does it for in here. Let's see here. Was this actually blocked on the outside? Yes, yes it is. If you get close enough, then it opens up. Interesting. And it opens up all the time if you're shrunk. Very interesting. So there's secrets behind gears. I gotta watch for that stuff. Sounded like a pig snout. Where is it? I hear you, snout. I will get you. Ooh, a little lag there. Snout. Ooh, there you are. I bet you I can't just drop down, so I am going to head over here. Why, thank you. Where is this going to take me? Ah, another keyhole. What have we here? Another memory. Alice was often alone. An interior and lonesome child, I suspect. Her sister, though loving and much loved, was too old to be a playmate. So she does have a sister. So that makes me think that the photograph was probably sent by her sister. If anyone. Of course, there's also 
a lot of random creepy people in Alice's life at this point, so I guess it's entirely possible someone who's creepy sent it to her. Who knows? Who indeed? Is there anything in any of these? Just a road so far. There's some teeth. Clock almost uh, reminds me a bit of a broken heart. Like the pieces are missing around it, but uh, I'm guessing it was never meant to look like that. Teapot lights. <laughs> That's kind of cool. Alright, what do we have down here? You are not a teapot light. You are an iPod, apparently. Alright, iPod. Let's see what you can do. Whoa! Okay, you're a little bit fast. Should probably focus on you. Watch it. Whoa. You are dangerous. There we go. Watch out. Okay, so if I hit it too fast, then he attacks immediately. Nice. You're not so bad. Great, an iPod and one of those things. I should probably take that thing out first. Whoa! Okay, so you can fire random coffee bits. Is that milk? That's totally milk. Yeah, that says tactation or lactation. <laughs> okay. Focus on you. <laughs> you hit your own guy. Good job. Ow. Good job, you hit me. You get one point. One point is all you get, though. Finger pointing the way or something. He's breaking that for me. Also, thanks for waiting for me to turn that. Much appreciated. Let's do this. Whoa, two of you. Oh, this is bad news. Ouch. This is very bad news. 